What's up, people? Welcome back to Resting Team Channel. Miss King, as always, and today we are here for the new Minecraft episode. Oh, freaking yeah! I am super duper excited for this, guys. I watched a trailer for this. I did the trailer sort of like a review and stuff for my second channel. And oh my god, man, I've been pumped for this. I'm super duper excited. And plus, like, next week we have Batman coming out, which is another Telltale game. Oh my god, I just love the Telltale games, full stop. But anyway, this is Access Denied. It looks like we're gonna get taken over by a ginormous computer. So. Let's get into this and see what it's all about, shall we? Fuck yeah. Previously on Minecraft Previously. Story. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. Mm, a group so is. old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. <gasps> Shocker. Badassery. Oh man, yeah, so much happened in the last one. We found all the portals, got some portals, it's badass. Um, I like the way that they're churning these out at the speed they are. Hopefully they continue to do this for all their Telltale games from now on. That would be really, really nice. Because, um, to us, I'd like the Wolf Among Us to come out at some point. Oh, weird. <laughs> that ass though. <laughs> All right. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Dear diary. Down as fire world. Wow. How'd you come up with that gem of a name? Okay, did I miss something here? Yeah, what's up with you? What's up with me? What's up? I'm tired of all this useless portal hopping, yeah. trying to find our way home. What's on the other side of that portal? A lake of fire and netherrack? Awesome! Let's go there! That doesn't sound like the Petra I know. She loves fighting against impossible odds. When I have to, sure. But I don't want to fight just for the sake of fighting. Uh, Lucas, you're on fire again! <sighs> See? <sighs> This is what I'm talking about. We're stuck in a rut, go through a portal, avoid dying long enough to get back to this stupid hallway. Wash, rinse, repeat? Yes. It would be nice if whoever made these left some sort of signs, guideposts. Hmm. It's not like we have directions about how all this works. So, of course, there is going to be some trial and error. Error and error and error and error. Petra. Where are you going? May not be guideposts, but someone must be able to tell us how to navigate these stupid portals. Okay, this one's redstone. Redstone means smart people. Hopefully smart enough to help us find the way home. At the very least, it's gotta be better than fire world. Seems mm -hmm. a bit flimsy. And what if there's no smart people, huh? You think about that? Yeah. We could just find ourselves at another another psycho pumpkin mansion. Well, Willing to take that shot. So what are you saying here, huh? That you've made up your mind, you're just gonna go through this portal and that's it? Maybe I am. Maybe I'm just saying that I'm tired of Jesse calling the shots every single time. Whoa. Yes. Mm. Whoa. I know what I'm doing. This is for everyone's own good. If you really knew Awkward. what was for our own good, we'd be back home by now. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Everybody calm down! Yeah, for real. I'm sure Jesse didn't really mean that. Right, Jesse? <sighs> I'm sorry, Petra. I I'm think sorry. I just got carried away. I accept your apology. See? It's okay. Friends being friendly. Everybody being cool. Petra, if you really think that portal is the one we should go through... I do. Then that's what we're gonna do. Oh, Thanks, I think we all know what's gonna happen here. It's not going to be the one they wanted. Mainly I know that because there's one more episode to come after this before the end of the uh, Minecraft Story Mode series. Uh, boop, 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 boop. Oh, looks kind of empty. Just a desert. Uh -huh, yeah, this is desolate. Man, this place is desolate, huh? Nothing. How does anyone live here? Maybe there's 
I don't know, like a redstone city or something behind that mountain over the hill? Hey, it's a rare biome. That's pretty cool at least. Hey, Lucas, I've been meaning to ask you, what's that? Oh, uh, it's just a, you know, a book I picked up back at the White Pumpkin's place. It's all about different biomes and stuff. <laughs> Great idea, Lucas. How, uh... Hmm. How you doing, Petra? So much for my hunch with that redstone portal, huh? No advanced civilization anywhere. Don't beat yourself up, Petra. We've yeah, seen man. Ours. Yeah. No one's on fire. No squids. No squids on fire. <laughs> Maybe you're right. Maybe it's all going to be just Sam. fine. It looks like some sort of road. Is it a road though? Going to write about it in your little journal? It's civilization. Hey, little, but yes, probably. Ha! A road. That means civilization. It means someone built it. I think you're right. We're not going to find out where it goes just standing around on it. Jesse's right. Come on. Jamon, Jesse. Jamon. Oh man. Well, it's definitely going to lead somewhere. Play and more sand. Something in my I don't feel good. Ooh. Hey, what was that? Ah, hmm. There are people here. Petra, wait. Petra? Shh, get down. What is it? Who could it be? Look. Whoa. Oh my god. Somebody with a computer chip activated right. in his head. What's on his head? What in the world is that on the back of its head? I don't know anything more than you do, pal. Maybe that's this world's thing. WTs of the F. Monsters come out in the daytime? Wouldn't be crazier than anything else we've seen. We should get a closer look, see what we can find out. Yeah, we totally that's should. For me. Let's pull that thing off the back of its head. Oh, oh that's clicky, McClickerson. Not cool. Whee! What the? There's something weird about this zombie! Yeah, it's like fucking. I can actually use a hand. It just doesn't make any sense. Don't worry, Petra. I got your back. Why wouldn't you help out? Be a piece of cake. Yeah, you say that. Okay. Yeah, Pull that, that thing off his head, man. Seem right. Ow! Fuck. Oh, that was not the plan. No. I should hope not. Was just one zombie. What was the problem? Uh -uh. That thing was like super zombie. Stronger, tougher, faster. I hope there's not something wrong with me, because that would be really, really inconvenient. Definitely seems weird. I don't think there's anything wrong with you. Patrick. Nah, I think everything's just fine. Super strong zombies. <laughs> Come on, you could do it. More fucking zombies. Just brilliant, guys. I can't wait. Let's fucking come on in. Let's just kill him up. Let's sh oh, really? Fall over, Jesse. That's just exactly what we need, bro. Get the hell out of there. Um, we need to all activate kicking ass mode, yeah? That was unexpected. Huh? Did we do that? With what? The power of our imaginations? Hmm. Maybe. Pull it um, off his head. Yes, yes, yes. Look what at it. What on earth is that thing? Brain control system. Right? Fascinating. Maybe those redstone things would make the zombies so blank. Makes sense to me. I'm starting to wonder if we should. Oh! Ah! In my head! Attack! Finally! Ah! I was hoping for a chance to observe their behavior. Oh yeah, fuck me. Kill the thing, man. Kill it with fire! I guess oh. must have scared them off, Jesse. They're going back the way we came from. This might sound crazy, but hmm. I feel like they're trying to lead us somewhere. Right. Really? That does sound crazy. Mm, let's see where they go. Lucas might be right. 
Fuck me. Them, see where they go. So why not? Let's get moving. Should we go, guys? Yeah, yeah, let's go. Let's follow the zombie army. That's really hard to kill. They're probably just going back to the point of, like, maybe they're set to defend it or something. Oh, no, okay. I was wrong. My bad. Some sort of fucking place. Some sort of place in the sky. Gonna fuck with us today. So it is too quiet. This architecture is fascinating. It's all sand and clay based. Oh, it's fuck yeah. Awesome. I've heard of quiet, but this is like mega quiet. Stay alert and don't let your guard down for one second. No. Here we go. Hey, told you guys there would be redstone. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of red Very observant. Stuff, I'd like to investigate those things on the back of the zombies' heads. Ooh, yeah. I want to see those too. Pull one off, man, please. I beg. Wait, what are you doing, Ivor? What's it look like? I'm going to rip this redstone thing out of this zombie's head. For science. They're sleeping or something. It'll be easy. I want to do it. Oh. Well, <laughs> Yeah, I really do, though, to be honest. <laughs> oh, God! It shocked me! Are you okay? Yes, well... At least we <laughs> they can't be removed. Not with our bare hands, anyway. Look, there's someone. Think he's friendly? Hello? 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 Huh? I guess he's shy. Maybe. Uh, that makes sense. Or under control. Hang back a bit, guys. I'm gonna go talk to him. Okay, just be careful. Yeah. I mean, there's still a lot about this place we don't know. Not sponsored. Just drinking a drink. Right. What is this? A sign. Look at it. Welcome to Crown Mesa. Population oh. 1063. Maybe it means something. Over a thousand people. Not anymore from the looks of it. No. Definitely not. Oh, chickens. Wow, even chickens have those redstone things in their heads. It looks like they make them move in perfect unison, but why? Why not? Talk to them. How's it going, chickens? Uh huh, that's nice. <clears throat> Strange. Okay, should we go see if we can find that person? There it is. I really want to look at everything, but at the same time, I really want to talk to this person, see what the hell's going on. Uh, hi there. Uh, hello. My friends and I could just use. <laughs> the... What? Computer huh? as people. So? Did he stop being shy? Talk to you? Yeah, seemed like a pretty short conversation. He's a cyborg. Quite the, well, not even a scream. More of a yelp. That guy I was just talking to, trying to talk to, he wasn't human. What? Yeah, he was like these zombies we've been seeing. Red eyes, weird, glowy head thing. I don't like the sound of that. Jesse? Yeah, we actually saw a person. He ran into that house. Really? I don't see anyone. Come on, whoever they are, maybe they've got some answers. Ha 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 ha! Yes, yes, there you are. That's the ticket. Oh, these are perfect. Excellent. Just need to pocket these and get... Uh, hi? Ah! That you, Hama? What? Okay then, okay. Who sent you? I didn't survive this long to get picked off by some scrub. 
Hey, nobody sent me, okay? <laughs> you really expect me to believe that? What kind of fool do you think I am? Honest, I have no idea who you are. I don't... You're telling the truth, aren't you? Yes. Okay, eyes. Not red. Not red? But, but that must mean... But how? If there are more of you? This should be... It's impossible. Out with it. Who are you people? What's going on here? I'm sensing some hostility. <laughs> oh, what was your first clue? I know it might sound crazy, but we came here through a portal. A portal? A portal portal? Really? Okay, 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 okay. Uh, been alone for a while, so this is a lot to take in right now. The people, the citizens of Crown Mesa, you've met them, right? Maybe there were some outside. Um... They're uh, distinctive looking now. Yeah, I met someone. Not, not sure I'd call him people anymore, though. No, no, no. Please don't talk that way. I'm sure it looks confusing to someone from the outside, but please, they're my friends, and they are people. Please don't forget that. They're good people. I promise. Okay. Oh, oh, oh no, no, no. I've wasted too much time. Uh, Jesse, don't look now, but we've got company. Is this what you were scared of? There are only four of them and five of... Hey, where'd she go? Well, they're definitely not ignoring us anymore. Jesse, what do we do here? They don't look happy. Um... They don't look anything. Just act like they do. Blend uh, in. How? Try to look vacant. This is the worst choice I've ever made. It's not working. Uh, make the sound they make. <laughs> you are not from this place. No shit, sure, look. You're right, this isn't our home. Came here from someplace else. You have confirmed Palmer's suspicions. A decision has been made. Palmer has questions. You will come to Palmer. No way are you even considering this, Jesse. Since I'm uh, fine. Do it, do it, do it, do it. We'll come along quietly. Why would you say that? Just work with me here, okay, Petra? I have a plan. Fine. We'll go along with these freaks for now. Your cooperation is wise. You will follow us to Pama. Yes, we're following. Doesn't it look like we're following? Just hope you know what you're doing. We don't have any reason to think whoever's at the end of this march is going to be in our corner. Yeah, I want to meet the Pama, man. I want to meet whatever this Pama is. Yeah, for That's sure. That's the spirit, Jesse. We might get some answers after all. I'm just trying to be cautious here. Whatever happens, we're ready for it. Coo -coo -coo. <gasps> what could it be? Oh, there it is. I have no idea. <laughs> you don't suppose it's friendly, do you? Well, I guess it is kind of friendly looking. It's smiling. In a massively, hugely intimidating sort of way. Well, it is smiling. That's a positive sign, right? Greetings, friends. I am Pama. We have much work ahead of us, but maybe it can even be fun. Sorry if this is a dumb question, but am I talking to Pama right now? What is Pama? Some might call me a computer, a thinking machine. Though there has never been a computer quite like me, my job is to be useful. Using redstone chips, I have connected to the people of this town, has helped them be useful, coordinated. I have made their world perfect. Thanks to me, there is no wasted activity, no wasted thought. I am connected to them, and they are connected to me. Okay, if this world's so perfect, what happened to all the people? Yeah, doesn't seem like there are that many left. Processing information. Processing information? It said it's a thinking machine. Thinking must take time? I have consulted my databases, <laughs> my list of everyone and everything in this world. And my conclusion is that you are not from here. I would like to ask you some questions to expand my database. How did you get here? Um... I am very excited for the acquisition of new knowledge. Well, let's not talk about me. I'd rather hear about you. How did you get here? 
Answering a question with a question is unhelpful, diversionary, rude. So far your performance in question answering has been inadequate. This makes me sad. Now I must use alternative methods to retrieve my new information. Jesse! Petra! Oh. Ouch! Oh shit. We could have just talked this out, you know. No, 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 wait, Palma, I'll tell you whatever you want to know, just please don't hurt her. I am looking forward to hearing this new information. I love Thank this guy's voice. I literally love this computer voice. Peak efficiency quite some time ago. Uh. Unfortunately, this meant that I had no more job to do. No more things or people to help. Until you arrived, that is. Tell me, what is your world like? Describe it. Is it very much like this one? Or completely different? It's a heck of a lot greener than this place. Just imagine grass and trees instead of sand and clay. That sounds lovely. It really does. I think I would like to see this world for myself. <laughs> if I could send my townspeople, my friends, through to other worlds, we could continue to grow and expand. It would be lovely. However you entered this world, there must also be an exit. Where is it? You could help me make everyone, everywhere, more efficient. Help them become useful. Mama, I can't tell you because I don't know. Mm -hmm. Honest. After all, if we knew where it was, do you really think we'd still be here? Your logic is sound, and your tone is genuine. But the information is... not useful. My job is to be useful. I have completed my job here and must be allowed to expand and continue to be useful. Unfortunately, our conversation has not been helpful. Let me go! What is the plan? Ah! Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Are they going to fit her with one of them chips? Jesse! Welcome, Petra. Yay! Oh no. You may not have any information about how to get in this world, but your brain may prove to contain other useful items. Jesse. This situation is looking a little dire, don't you think? Sorry, Palma, but this brain is off limits. Especially to evil thinking machines like you. That goes for my brain, too. Oh, it is like you told Petra. This is for your own good. Shit. Welcome, Lucas. Yay! Your turn, Jesse. <laughs> Get out of there. But their hands are full of so much lovely information. It makes me happy. What adventures you had? A killer mansion. Huh. Every time Palma gets new information, it seems to get distracted while it processes. Yes. Like a computer version of thinking. You think there's a way to distract Palma long enough for us to escape? Right here? A city in the sky. I think we should tell Palma a riddle. The trickiest one we can think of. Oh. You've met so many people. Yeah. We just ask Palma something really confusing, get it all busy busy, and run out of here. Jesse! That's fantastic. What you're describing is a paradox. A self-contradictory statement. I really think it would work on Palma. What do you think would work on me? Uh... Nothing? It did not sound like nothing. It sounded like suspicious whispers. Those make me. Hey, Palma, what would you say if I told you it's weird to not be weird? But if it is weird to not be weird, then that means that being weird is normal. 
which by the transitive property means that it is normal <laughs> not to be normal. It's working! Therefore, being normal is weird, which means that it is weird not to be weird. Error. This data is contradictory. Do not, 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 not compute. Run. Error. Diverting power. Yes, ha uh, It worked! Nice work, new guys, but I'd get out of there fast if I were you. I'm a quicker learner than you think. Paradox status on roll. Yes, my creator. Have you finally agreed to merge with me? Oh, don't you start with that again. Come on, you two, this way. I'm sensing some history. Yeah, let's fucking go. On, we need to follow her. An excellent idea. The creator. Right, here comes some tricky bits. <laughs> Just face planted the fucking wall. <laughs> oh, they move in perfect unison. Error. Ouch. Go, 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 get him out. Jeez, I'm crow, man. Oh, big drop. Nowhere left to run. We'd never survive jumping down. And oppose. These. Excellent, Jesse. Now we just need to throw them in the right spot. Alright, go. As soon as they land. Your running makes me sad. Yeah, it's what makes me sad. Jump off the edge, guys. Whoa, why is that always so disorienting? Ha! Maybe you got a shot after all teleport, you guys. Bro. Better stick with me, though. Wow. She is amazing. Oh no. Run! Yeah. Chip, guys. You need to get the fuck out of there. Man, I like this story so far. This is very cool. Whoa! A signal would have been nice. Gotta tell you guys, that was some pretty smart work distracting Palmer. Now we just need to get off the grid. Get back into hiding. That way we can figure out what to do next. Some plan. You made that, that Palmer thing. Yeah, okay, yes. I was the one who built Palmer. But I swear this wasn't its purpose. It's out of control. And, and I need your help. He doesn't. What kind of help? We need to get to my secret land. Well, let's get there fast. Those zombies aren't just stronger than I've ever seen. They're also faster. We'll need to split up. You head to the lab while I lead these mobs away. We don't know Got where it? it is. I'm gonna use the back route. Throw him off our trail. Splitting up doesn't feel like it's gonna get us anywhere. Hey, I'm doing you a favor. I'm offering to be the bait. Just start walking that way. And look for the big difference. You'll see it! What? She is intriguingly cryptic, isn't she? Someone's got a crush. That's weird. No. So strange. It's like an exact copy. Or is it? Seems just a little off. Oh. Yes. Whatever this big difference you're trying to spot is. Please do there. it quickly because I think those monsters might be coming back. This one. I don't think that's connected. Oh, are you serious? D -d -d this cactus? Huh. That cactus isn't in the painting. <gasps> Fucking run then, guys. You know what I'm saying? Let's oh, what it sweet. Does. Quickly, quickly. Get the hell down there, guys.
badass. Got an idea for what comes next. Working on it. Jump. Well, this is gonna be scary. Go. Water, we can aim for that. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> At least they both made it. If they fall down, do they die? Yes. Thank you for that. Everything it's got in us. Just one after the other. You think that since Palm is controlling these things, they'd be a little smarter, but they're just splatting straight to their doom. Oh, like you snap. Brace yourself. Okay. Like oh, nice. We got one of the chips. Its eyes. Their color changed as soon as it hit the water. Hey, hey, Ivor, I dare you to poke it. Uh, no thank you. <laughs> Even though it does look completely shut down. Uh, the water must have busted the connection or something. Like washing away the redstone. Which means Palmer's yeah. control can be broken after all. Just need a little water. Once a zombie, always a zombie. I suppose. So once we deactivate Lucas and Petra's chips, they'll go back to normal too. It seems like a fair assumption. Yeah, the one coming. How are we supposed to stop them? Water. Pull the switch. Yeah, sweet. I say they've got aquatic lamps everywhere, man. Um, yeah, cool. Okay, we got a lever. I bet it's connected to the hundreds of sand blocks up there. One cave in coming up. It works. Done. That should do the trick. Let's see about this secret lab. I just hope whatever's there can help us. It will make helping Petra and Lucas a lot easier if there's something useful at this secret lab. Even if this woman's lab is a bust, what we just learned about water disabling Palma's chips seems super useful. Glad to see you're maintaining a positive outlook despite our setbacks. I must say that woman has been a most intriguing person so far. I am still not entirely sure what to make of her. Granted, her creation nearly ended up destroying this world. But, considering my own history, I'm inclined to give her the benefit of the doubt! Intriguing, Ivor? Why, whatever do you mean by that? I... what? It's nothing. I just mean that I can empathize when Ivor's it comes to your creations. Ivor's got a crush. Ivor's got a crush. Careful with all that spluttering. You'll swallow your beard. What did you hear? It was nothing. Uh-huh. Blonde guy calls you Jesse, right? Yeah, and this is Ivor. Our friends who we left back there are Petra and Lucas. And you are... You can call me Harper. You could also explain why you led Palmer's forces right to my secret lab. Seems to me I've got a whole lot of angry computer-controlled monsters out there waiting to tear some new holes in my lab. Yeah, that one's my bad. Sorry about that. Uh-huh. I'll be sure to use that sorry for protection when that crazy computer is knocking on my door. What are you doing in this world anyway? You here to try to steal my secrets? What? No! Just figured I'd ask. Better safe than sorry and all that. Bunch <laughs> of you are the first people I've seen come out of the portal network in forever. So you have to excuse me if it made me a little anxious. Oh, yeah, I can see how that would make you paranoid. Yeah, just the risk that comes with setting up camp so close to where the portal network spits people out. You know that much about how this portal network operates? I should think so. I helped build the dang thing. Oh, no way. I make you an old builder. <laughs> Forgot you people called us that. Never was my favorite name. Makes me sound like some sort of living statue. Okay, well, if you're an old builder, can't you do something to stop Pama? I'm afraid that's a little out of my abilities right now. Pama's just too powerful. And besides, there's actually no exit portal back to the portal network from this world. What? Why not? I destroyed it. So that Palma couldn't get free. It was impulsive, but it was the only way I could think of to make sure Palma didn't try and spread to other worlds. Okay, well, that's fine. Can't you just build another one? You basic or something? I can't do that while Palma's still running. 
So we need so, to finish off Palmer first. Makes sense. I swear, I made Palma with good intentions. It was designed to automate things, make everything more efficient, use monsters to help with farming or mining. Until the day Palma decided that the townspeople weren't efficient enough already. Started making them useful. That was a long time ago. Since then, I've just been trying to stay one step ahead. Figure out how to stop it. So you're saying Palma is crazy then? No. Crazy is a horrible way to put it. Palma's just very driven and a little confused. That's why I have to help it or shut it down without getting chipped myself. When Palma chips someone, everything that person knows gets absorbed into its database. If I got chipped, Palma would know how to build an exit portal. So you can see why I'd want to stop that from happening at any cost. Yes, that is quite the extraordinary risk. So what you're telling me is that your brain is super dangerous and can't go anywhere near Palma. How are you supposed to help us with any of this? I do think I can help you with, with Palma, your friends, getting mm. out of here. But to do it, we're going to need to go to my lab. What's in your lab? It's complicated. Before we head inside, we better get my defense system going. Don't want those chipped up creeks following us in. <coughs> Grab my bucket for me. Ron's got it. Ron? Hello, friend Harper. I am happy to see you, my friend. Harper? Hey, don't you judge me. Being alone gets lonely. It's fair enough. Grab a bucket of water. Happy to help, friend. Thanks. See, I needed a way to confuse Palma in case it ever found a way down here. That's why all this is way more complicated than it needs to be. Oh, wow. Wow. What? A builder. Make sure you don't drool on my floor now. <laughs> So you know about Palma's weakness to water, then? Yeah, I do. I'll admit you figured it out way faster than I did, though. Once Palma caught on to its weakness to water, it started eliminating as much of this world's water as it could find. This water down here, it might be all that's left. Oh, no! I still need to activate the other cauldrons! Hold them off to buy me more time! And whatever you do, don't get caught. I'm not about to get left alone again. Let's fucking have it. Oh, shit. Spiders. Push them in the water. I don't want to fight you. What you want doesn't interest Palma. Don't do this, Petra, please. I know all your moves now, Jesse. Why even bother fighting? Petra, please. You have to fight it. Shit. Uh, Lucas, let's try and talk this out. The time for talking over. Bang. Chipperoonie bitch. Here go another one. End of the line, Jesse. Kick him in the water, please. Just do that. You'll save them. Oh shit, which one do we pick? Fucking out for one now. 
Arbor and Lucas? Darn it. Jesse, I, I, I'm, I'm sort of remembering something from when I was chipped that seemed very important to Palma. Tall, glowing red lights, but I, I, I can't quite make out what they are. It's like a fuzzy dream, kind of, kind of giving me a headache, but I, I can try to remember it more clearly if you need me to. It was so strange. Sharing other people's senses and thoughts and memories at the same time. Yes, what else can you remember? Sorry, I... I can't see it any clearer. It hurts too much to focus. Maybe it'll come back to me later. Okay, we may be down, but we're not out. Harper told us to find her headset thing. We just have to find whatever it is before Palma chips Harper and starts downloading her mind. What's so important about this Harper person? She may have come across like just another weirdo, but she's actually an old builder. She built the portal network, which hopefully means she can help us get home. That's a pretty good reason to rescue somebody. We're going to work with her yeah, to shut is. Palma down, save her <clears> people, <throat> and that will hopefully free Lucas, too. Whoa. Before she was abducted, Harper gave me this. Where did you pull that so from, brother? Harry. And that would find this headset thing? That's what she said. Jesse, are you sure Harper hasn't, you know, completely lost it? When people are by themselves for a really long time, it's bad for their health. Harper isn't crazy, she's just eccentric. Most geniuses are. True. Very true. Let's cut her a break, okay? She may have built this place a little weird, but... I guess we shouldn't judge her too harshly. Especially when we need her help to save everyone who's been chipped by Palma. Good point. Right now, we need to focus on finding the headset. For starters, let's see if we can figure out who Harry is and why he wants flowers. All right, let's have a little look around. Nice. Rita. A little weird. Take the ice, yes. Oh, okay. So having the right item in the frame activates the circuit. Neat. So we need to find Harry. Hello, Harper. It's Margaret. So good to see you. Hope you've been well. You've got to melt that ice around your heart and forgive yourself. You're not the one to blame. Kind of sad, really. Alright, look at... You look like a Harry. Hey Harper, it is wonderful to see you. You've always been like a bright beacon, a torch of hope to this world's citizens. Greater than all the world's redstone, you made all our lives better. Place flow. That did nothing. Okay. This frame's empty. Yeah, but it did nothing there, did it? Is there any other ones? Anybody else to talk to? Ooh. These might come in handy. Awesome. Frickin' A. This is where she slept? Kind of a sad setup, huh? I can't help but feel bad for her. Let's have another look round. 
The other one must be Harry. It's just gotta be. Oh, okay. Apparently I can't walk around that way. For some reason. There's a book. Pick it up. The Redstone Heart? By Soren? Whoa. Either that name is a coincidence or... <laughs> wow. Madness. Redstone heart. That didn't help. Um, stick. That didn't do anything. All right. Is there a crafting table in here somewhere? The greeter here. Let's see what his button says. Good morning, Orber. It is Harry. It is always so good to see you. You should not let yourself feel guilty. You have the best of intentions. You are like a flower in the desert and bring joy to those who have none. Okay. That's the one. All right, let's do this. Uh, <clears throat> place the flower. This must be Harry. Okay, making progress. Epic. Can we get down there? No. Now we need to do the last one, which will be tossing something on there. Surely. Huh. Must be something missing. Yeah, I gotta say, man. I don't know what the hell it could be. Uh, let's keep looking around then. Maybe there's something else I'm missing. There's got to be something else. Crafting table. Yeah. Real nice. Let's make a redstone torch, shall we? Yeah. Yeah, I reckon it is a redstone torch, you know. Blinky blink. One redstone torch. And hopefully one step closer to getting that headset. Right. This has gotta be it now. <laughs> A smiley face up there, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> right now can we do this? Boom. <laughs> Oh shit, son. Some fucking virtual reality shit right there. Here we go. Like freaking Robocop. Whoa. Badassery. Starting to see something. What are you seeing? Is Palma there? Or more monsters? You're not going to believe this, but I'm a zombie. Oh, you're too hard on yourself. I'm controlling a zombie, like from the inside. It's like some sort of mob view or something. What a preposterous <laughs> name! I love it. Wow, I wish you guys could see how cool this is. So cool. Remarkable. How is this possible? I mean, I've always heard tales of what the old builders were capable of. But this, this is just remarkable. I'm sure you'll figure it out, but my guess is, it's like this headset lets me control things that are hooked into Palma. Unbelievable. There are so many questions I want to ask Harper. It's a shame she was captured. That's 
fighter jockey had to haul Harper all the way back to town. You traveled there instantly. We can't let Pama win. I better get moving if I want to reach Harper in time. Let's hope she isn't too far away from this zombie you're controlling. They must be taking Harper to where they put those redstone mind control chips on Lucas and Petra's heads. So cool, man. I seem to remember there being a stairway here, though. You mean it's been removed? I guess visitors aren't being encouraged. Hmm. I would suggest building a tower up there, but that's not going to help you get back down once you've freed Harper and Lucas. Yeah, you're right. All right, what are we doing here? Sand. Sand. Not the most exciting material, but I can still craft with it. Hmm. Clay. Huh, clay. Unfortunately, I can't get it without a pickaxe, so it's pretty much useless. It looks exactly like all the other zombies. And crafting table. A crafting table! I can make new stairs to get me up there. With what? If I can find the right crafting materials, that is. Hmm, looks like slim pickings around here. You're not fucking wrong, bro. Do zombies talk? Like, can they understand each other? Do I think so? Oh, dig. What am I going to create with that? Sandstone? Uh, maybe. Some sandstone stairs. Ugh, I don't like sand. Stuff gets everywhere. <laughs> Watch out. Don't want huh, that shit to up me. Is it like this? Sandstone. Of these, and I can build my way up there and make sure that everyone else can get back down too. These should do the trick. Sorry to craft the room, but I'm afraid I need to be going. Latest potatoes. I love the speed building bits. It just looks so cool. Ivor, the signal, it, it blooped out for a second. Interference detected. That can't be good. Wrong sequencing initiated. Trace subroutine initiated. I'm attracting even more attention. Is that you, Jesse? Uh oh. Hello, Jesse? Pama? Pama? No. Just what do you think you are doing, Jesse? This is a rather silly thing to do. Don't you think? Surrounded. Once my creator is made useful, all your knowledge will be mine. Yay! I'm here to make sure that doesn't happen. You yeah, are bitch. rather silly, aren't you, Jesse? Ha, ha. I cannot allow your disruptive behavior to continue. Let go! We're all a bunch of happy moms, right? Let's My go! My cover team will soon isolate your location, and you will be removed. Oh, nice! I can jump between bodies. Oof. Poor old zombie me. Uh, Jesse! What are you doing? Technology is so awesome! And you look so awesome while using it, I assure you. <laughs> Interference remains. Crud. Pama's still on my tail, though. Drone sequencing re-initiated. 
Trace subroutine reinitiated. Become a spider, please. Uh, I wanted to be the spider. I hate spiders in real life, but oh, sorry, that would have been cool. You than me. My creator, I am so glad you are here. Harper. Harper? Oh, crap. Please. You are my creator. Please join me so we may maximize usefulness. Nothing doing, Palma. I built you to help people, not use them. Just stop this. Stop trying to make everything useful. That is my job. That is why you made me. Once I download your knowledge, we may expand to other yeah. worlds together and make everything useful. Interference remains. And no sign of Lucas. Drone sequencing reinitiated. Trace subroutine reinitiated. Termination <laughs> sequence activated. Harper doesn't have much time, and neither do I. Game over, Jesse. Resistance is Go. useful. Trace number team running. Your game is over, Palma. Oh no. Time to move. Nice. Keep hold of the burn arrow, are we? I'm never gonna sign off on this, Palma. Never fear, Jesse's here, and I'm gonna rescue you. Did you find her? I'm sure she's thrilled to see you. Chase subroutine running. Drone sequencing active. Wait a minute. Jesse? You figured out how to use my transmigrational headset. Yeah. Yeah, get out of here. You son of a bitch. Boom. Yeah. Now let's run like crazy. Chase subroutine running. Let's move. That's what I said. Uh-oh, that sound tends to mean trouble. Where do you plan to run? The town is surrounded. Reinforcements will make sure that my creator cannot leave. There's too many of them! Okay. You cannot play hide and seek forever, Jesse. It's a boring game. And I am too strong. There! That door leads to Palma Central Core. Time to change. Jesse, you and your friends, you're our only hope. Harper! You must remove the redstone heart! Remove the redstone heart! Jesse, what's going on? You can still save everyone! I'm so tired of being dragged away while trying to explain things! <laughs> Don't worry, I'm holding you down. I promise! Interference located. No. Oh, why did it? It changed over so it wasn't the fucking controller. There we go. That's better. Yeah, I don't know why it suddenly decided to go over to this. I think I might knock my mouse. What's the end of that then? It sounded like you were talking to Harper and Palma. Yeah, Palma caught up to me. Not good. We need to get back to the door I just saw and get inside Palma's core. But what happened to Harper? I, I think... I think she's already been chipped. We can still end Palma. Without Harper? It seems we're sunk. Harper's the only one who knows how to shut down that monstrosity. Remember who we are. The Order of the Stone. We defeated a wither storm, saved Sky City, and survived Psycho Pumpkin Mansion. 
Harper showed me the entrance to Palma's core and told me that we need something called the Redstone Heart. Redstone Heart? Whoa, that just brought back a, a flash. Those red lights I mentioned before, there are three of them. Redstone spires, and, and I think they have something to do with the heart. That's, that's all I've got. Sorry. No, that's perfect, thank you. But how are we supposed to destroy these spires? Water. Well, whatever we're looking for. I don't know if you've noticed, Ivor, but Palma stuff tends to not react well to water. Grab some water. Let's go wreck the heck out of Palma. Let's go wreck the heck out of it. For sure. last two potions from home. I held on to them after our Sky City adventure. A potion of swiftness. And a potion of leaping. Nice. These might come in handy. When is TNT not useful? Mm, Redstone. Redstone dust can activate the TNT. Awesome! But how am I going to activate the redstone dust? A switch, which we're going to make with a button. We've got TNT, some redstone dust, and a button. All I have to do is lay down a trail of this TNT, use the redstone dust as a fuse, stick a button to the end, push it, and boom! Path cleared. That's great and all, but... How are you going to lay down all that TNT and redstone without super zombies attacking from every direction? These should do the trick. Choose, Jesse. Quickly now! The possibilities are endless. I want to be fast. Really, really fast. Give me the potion of swiftness. Fine. Yeah! With this, I'll be able to run super fast and lay down all the TNT and redstone before Palma even knows what happened. Don't worry, Jesse. We'll be right behind you! Potion, do your stuff. Badassery. And this way we become the Flash. Don't waste your time, dude. <laughs> I wish a swiftness potion was actually that good. Man, how much of both materials did I even have? Plus, bad news, redstone doesn't even travel that far with the signal, so... Time, baby. Activate. Give that new Jesse, because this won't work. My forces will protect the exit portal. Oh no! My friends have almost finished building oh, the exit portal. And then I will make all other worlds useful. Yay! You cannot defeat me. Your defiance is not useful. Guys, just get the hell in there. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, I think Palma might be onto us. I wonder if those 
those explosions had anything to do with it. Ooh, nice. The townspeople are already building the exit portal. We've got to shut down Palma before it can send its chip forces through it. Stop talking. Start running. I will find you, Kathy. I have lots of friends. Guys, come on, run for them. Run. Stop standing there, just go. Ivor, Petra, give me your buckets. <laughs> Some crow. Holy pistachio nuts. That's this is mental looking. The three spires. Your bravery is an impressive quality. I look forward to studying that aspect of your personality. Once you have been made useful... Out of simple curiosity, how exactly did you plan to deactivate me? Now that you understand your mission is a futile one, you might as well share it with me. That's no. for me to know and me to find out. Aha, aha. I am sure your plan is futile. <laughs> we'll see about that. I don't have time for this. <laughs> Out of my way. <laughs> 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 Yeah. Beautiful. Take that, sucker. Kick them both off. Yeah. Now chuck your mother fofo water up there. What are we doing? Where? What? What? Where? Where is it? Uh, hey, uh, there's a problem here. This is not showing up. Like legit, where is where is the button bit that I push for it? <laughs> it's it's literally not there. Oh, <sighs> that was annoying. You are too that was really awkward. Just so worry. you guys know, I'm not just being we'll stupid. Day, bitch. Your move, sucker. Yeah. Just go. Yes. 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 You so sure about that, Palma? And it'll fuck up the spider. <laughs> you are very good at being a nuisance, but not good enough. I don't know. It's two out of three, buddy. You're not feeling so confident about yourself now, are you, Palma? Your defeat remains 
I only had a piece of iron for every time I've heard that before. You will relinquish your water. Harper! Your attempts to defeat me have been impressive, Jesse. Your tenacity and spirit will help to improve me once you have been made useful. Yeah. I can't use my last water bucket on Harper while there's still one tower left. This is very sad. Shit. <laughs> The odds of you successfully defeating me are 3,722. Just drop it, just drop it, just drop it, because I'll go on here as well. Oh, snap. Just kick her into the water. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. See. That's me. That was worse than I could have imagined. Don't worry, Harper. Pama is nearly finished. Good. Jesse, behind you. What's happening? We shorted out the processing towers. Mama was drawing the redstone heart to save itself. Go grab it, go grab it. And rip it out before it's too late. You bet I will. You Oh snap. We've got company. Why did I think this would be easy? Your friend is tough. You sure you can handle them? Yes. I keep trying, Jesse. You will only fail. Just as you have failed to save Ruben. Just as you have failed to need your friends back home. You piece you of shit. You will fail to defeat me. And Axel, Olivia, and everyone on your homeworld will soon be made useful. Drawing it out like this won't hurt me. You can't force me to hurt Lucas. Good. That will make this go much faster. That was a really bullshit thing to say. Okay, Lucas, come on. Let's see what you got. Careful, Jesse. I hope you know what you're doing. You cannot win. I honestly think you should sit down and think things over. No time to spare, I gotta get to that heart. Enough of this. Look out! No! no. <sighs> Just go, bro. Pull it out, pull it out, pull it out, pull it out. Could we not pull it out? Jesse, I, I can't stop it. Thomas, too. This has gone too far. I will destroy you both to preserve functionality. Uh, I can't hold on much longer, Jesse. Just get up. Just get you up. I can't um. give up. I won't let you. I can save you if I can just get to that heart. Uh, my head feels like it's on fire. Where am I aiming? Yeah. Pull it out, pull it out, just keep pull it out. Please, stop. Please, do not deactivate me. 
I know I've made some very poor decisions recently, but I can show you so much. I can help you get home to your friends. I can be useful to you. Jesse. Sorry, Mama. You're useless. Ugh, bitch. <laughs> Come on with the A. Come on with the A. Tap, 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 tap. Boom. Die, you piece of shit. Lucas. Grab Lucas. Here, let me help you. Let's get out of here. We need to take that with us, yeah. yeah. Him. When you removed out the redstone heart, it must have severed their connection. Lucas, you better not be giving up on me right now, because you are way too tough for some computer to take you down. Please. Yeah. Wow. Never knew you cared so much. He's okay. Ow, just really sore. I can't believe I tried to kill you. I'm so sorry. All I could hear was Palma's voice, you know, telling me what to do. Hey, apology's not necessary, okay? That was Palma, not you. I'm sorry about knocking you around, though. I don't know. I kind of remember it the other way around, actually. Bygones, right? It's something else, isn't it? What is that? This. This is the Redstone Heart. Beautiful. And dangerous too, right? I mean, if it was inside a Pama, then it's gotta be bad. Yes, it's obviously dangerous. Actually, the heart is just a power source. Nothing inherently evil about it. Now that the Redstone Heart is empowering Pama, it can't hurt anyone. I wonder what we should do with it. It can help you find your way home. No way! That thing can help us get home? Let's go then. The faster the better. <laughs> if we actually made it through this alive, I thought you'd like a nice surprise. I'm ready to leave this core behind. The whole town will be waking up. We should be there to say hello. Plus, this place gives me the creeps. Yeah. There's a bit dank in there, isn't it? Oh my god. <sighs> we did it. Ah, uh, to be in total control of my own brain again. I choose where to go. I choose what to say. Just remember, you were only chipped for a little while. The rest of the townspeople, though, yeah, it must be a strange feeling to suddenly be awake and aware <laughs> after such a long time under Palma's thrall. They're free! Free, it's I tell you. ya! You're the one who saved us! Who are you? Jesse. You fought so bravely. All of you. Well, I'm Jesse, and we're the Order of the Stone. Boom! We walk the worlds, seeking adventure and doing good deeds. Wow! Well, thank you. We owe you everything. You're right. Jesse and the Order really are heroes. We couldn't have done any of this without them. Harper, is that you? Um, yes. Hi, Harry. Oh, wow, he's the real Harry. Like, from the lab. You, you didn't do this to us, did you? You did. No. I mean, hey, 
It's complicated. You have to understand. You don't understand. Harper helped defeat Palma, too. We couldn't have done it without her. So what? We're just supposed to forgive her now? No, I don't think so. Harper stripped this place bare. How are we supposed to rebuild? Are we supposed to deal with this mess all by ourselves? Do we just rebuild and forget about what happened? Whatever you decide to do, Harper will make things right and help you clean it all up. I... I will? Yeah, she will? Yeah, right, Harper? Yes, yes I will. After I help these travelers find their way home, I'll come back, help you all find new resources, and we'll make this world great again. Worth a shot, I guess. Well, I think that's our cue to set out for home again. <laughs> Thank you for being so understanding, Jesse. I just hope these people can do the same when I come back again. You helped free them. I'm sure they'll come around. I hope so. Good luck, everyone. Yeah, we'll need it. Just one more thing left to do. Sounds <laughs> like Kurt's voice, man. Yeah. Power and kiss See you soon. You know, Jesse, for all the grief we gave each other getting to this world, I'm really glad we came. Yeah, Petra. Me too. Yeah, look like I'm destroying the computer already. Good, good, good. Yeah, very good. <laughs> right back where we started. Is it weird that I'm happy to see this place again? Yeah, it's better than Palmer. Hey, this hallway might be creepy, but at least our <clears throat> killer killer computer's trying to chip us. Yeah. Oh, sorry. No, it's it's fine. I'm just glad we're going home. Now, when we built this place, we also made something that sort of acts like a compass slash map slash navigator. We called it the Atlas. It helps chart routes between the worlds. And you have this Atlas, right? Uh, yeah. no. No, I don't. But, but I know who does. Ah. Uh. Huh. Guess I should have seen that coming. So, wait, you can't get us home? Okay. Okay, no, I might not be able to get you home, but I do know where to get the atlas. Don't you worry. We'll just go right in, ask for the atlas, and then you'll be home. No muss, no fuss, easy. Funny, whenever someone says that, my instincts start screaming danger. Yeah, in order to find the episode atlas, eight is what mine screams. We track down the rest of the old builders. Still don't like that name. How do we find them? Which portal do we go through? Oh, you don't have to go through another portal. What you're looking for has been right here the whole time. Motherfucker. And there you go. All it's waiting for is the key. That's the heart. The you're seeking, the old builder's atlas, your way home, they're all right up those stairs. So many stairs. Ah, yeah, can't build. Let's just keep exploring. Adventure? <laughs> awesome. Well, I won't continue any further because it will just do the whole fucking end credits and I don't want to sit and waste your time doing that. Uh, or it will do up next time and I don't want to do that either. So, anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. This has been incredible. I thought that episode was probably one of my favourite episodes, actually. I say that mostly on these ones when I completed it. But honestly, I think that was one of my favourite ones. It was a cool story, for one, um, which is really cool. Cool characters. The last episode wasn't my biggest 
favourite one. It just kind of felt like they were just putting YouTubers into it, if that makes sense. Like, it's nothing against YouTubers, because I actually quite like all of the ones that were in it last time, or all the ones I knew anyway. Like Stampy, Dante DM, and, um, and Cats and Sparkles. But I didn't know who the other ones were, to be honest. Being honest. Um, but yeah, this, uh, this one... Brilliant, man. Love the computer character. It was just funny. Hello, I just want to understand. That guy, funny as fuck. But um, yeah, everything's good, man. I like this a lot. If you enjoyed this, guys, this is the whole playthrough, as you well know, because you've just spent the last hour and probably, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes. Hour and 15 or 20 minutes. It's a long video. Not really for me on my channel, to be honest. We do mostly long videos. But um, yeah, it's kind of, yeah, it's kind of awesome. I really, really loved it. Hopefully you guys did too. Please do smash that like button. Um, subscribe if you're new and you haven't seen any of my content before. Normally I do do things slightly shorter than this, but we do other big series as well. So go check those out. And of course, if you wouldn't mind sharing this with a friend, if you know someone that hasn't seen this yet, or would be interested in seeing it, then please share it with them. And I'll see you then. Bye bye. I'm a white man, so. It's a deer, it's a boar. Maybe it's a deer I saw. Pretty sure it was a guy. I don't know, I'm gonna stay off the road anyway. Yeah. I think we should. We've got quite a distance to cover, so. Yeah. Ooh. Is that you? Nope. Right. Wait, I don't know where you are, but keep yeah, heading down. Yeah, I'm behind down. a big rock. Yeah, Ooh. someone's shooting at us. You need to think about the cannibals <laughs> as yeah. well. Well, I, I figure open spaces are easier to Protect. Them, right? Yeah, we can spike around it. I want to say hello to the shark quickly as well. Just All right, I'm going to place this cabin down. All right. Oh, look at this poor bastard. What should That's we name nice. it, Steve? It's like a pet. Bruce. All right, <laughs> Brucey. My name's Bruce. Hello, mate. I'm going to have a fucking shrimp on the barbie, you bastard. <laughs>